Department of Labor is promising not to turn a blind eye to a surge in child labor violations across the country. D.C.'s Raquel Martin reports as lawmakers are demanding reforms to protect migrant kids currently being targeted. It is absolutely unconscionable. Missouri Republican Senator Josh Hawley says it's time to crack down on companies that illegally employ and exploit migrant children. Tens of thousands of those kids are in forced child labor conditions at slaughterhouses, at factories. He says the problem starts with the Biden administration's border policy. Since he opened the border to child smugglers two years ago. Holly is introducing legislation requiring companies to submit annual independent audits of their labor practices to the Department of Labor. Root out all child labor from our supply chains. Child labor law violations are up 69% since 2018. To crack down, the Labor Department launched a special task force with 600 open investigations. The department is also calling on Congress to increase fines. Muzaffar Chisti, a senior fellow at the Migration Policy Institute, wants lawmakers to go further. And a criminal charge is much more effective than any fine. No one wants to go to jail. He also says Congress needs to increase funding. Under labor has been under-resourced for the last 30, 40 years. There are not enough resources for a labor inspector to go to a workplace even once in 30 years. The Labor Department would not comment on Holly's bill, but says the agency supports any increase in accountability or deterrence. In Washington, Raquel Martin.